1879. The Civil War is over, and the resulting economic explosion spurs the Great Migration West. Farmers, ranchers, prospectors, killers, and thieves seek their fortunes. Cattle growers turn cow towns into armed camps, with murder rates higher than those of modern-day New York or Los Angeles. Out of this chaos comes legendary lawman Wyatt Earp, retiring his badge and gun to start a peaceful life for his family. Earp's friend, John Doc Holliday, a southern gentleman turned gunman and gambler, also travels west, hoping the dry climate will relieve his tuberculosis. Silver is discovered in Arizona. Tombstone becomes queen of the boom towns, where the latest Paris fashions are sold from the backs of wagons. Attracted to this atmosphere of greed, over 100 exiled Texas outlaws band together to form the ruthless gang recognized by the red sashes they wear. They emerge as the earliest example of organized crime in America. They call themselves the Cowboys. The power of the cowboy gang was broken forever. Ike Clanton was shot and killed two years later during an attempted robbery. Maddie died of a drug overdose shortly after she left Tombstone. Virgil and Allie Earp moved to California where Virgil, despite the use of only one arm, became a town sheriff. Wyatt and Josephine embarked on a series of adventures. Up or down, thin or flush, in 47 years they never left each other's side. Wyatt Earp died in Los Angeles in 1929. Among the pallbearers at his funeral were early Western stars William S. Hart and Tom Mix. Tom Mix wept. <laughs>